Moose Knuckles Ballistic Bomber. So I finally got myself a new coat to replace the Canada Goose parka I've been wearing for the past couple seasons, and I really like it. I think it's a, uh, a nice change from the Canada Goose. It's a high quality piece from, new, uh, from Moose Knuckles, so I figured I'd uh, kind of walk through it in case you were interested in uh, uh, finding something to replace your Canada Goose or your Montclair. Uh, so uh, here it is. Here is the Ballistic Bomber. So it's a nice piece from Moose Knuckles. So it's got all the typical Moose Knuckles uh, logos, paraphernalia. Uh, they got the huge, you can see, here's my hand, uh, the huge uh, logo. They use a 9010 uh, down on it, so it's a nice high quality down. It'll definitely keep you warm. It purports to be waterproof. Uh, I have not yet, uh, you can see I still got the tags on it. I haven't had a chance to wear it. And they use uh, fox fur, which is a little bit different than uh, what Canada Goose uses. But it's uh, really soft, it's nice. So uh, I'll walk you through some of the uh, the things about it. So here's your Moose Knuckles logo. So again, it purports to look kind of like a moose footprint. Uh, some people say it looks like a heart. Some people say it looks like a brass knuckles, but whatever. It's not quite as flashy as the, the Canada Goose big patch like that. So it's a little bit more low key. It's nice. Also like the Canada Goose, you got the really nice tight uh, cuffs. So it really adapts to you, keeps you really nice and warm. That's one thing I really liked about this coat. When you're looking at some of the pockets, they're lined with a really high, high, high quality material in here. So it's, I know you can't feel it, but it's soft, it's really thermal, it's, it's warm, it's nice. <clears throat> when you're looking at some of the authenticity, in case you guys are trying to buy stuff online, you don't want to get ripped off. This stuff gets counterfeited all the time. So here's some of the things that you probably want to look for. So here's your authenticity seal. And what you need to see is that hologram. If you don't have the hologram, you are out of luck. Uh, Moose Knuckles got in trouble a couple of uh, seasons back. They had to make this little amendment on some of their uh, coats to say that it's not actually wholly made in China. Or, <laughs> China. It's not made in uh, Canada, but it is uh, assembled in Canada, and it, uh, it's of some imported material. So they had to make this little... Like I guess additional swatch over here and then they have the breakdown of where things come from so it's the uh, fox uh, fur and everything's all manufactured in Canada so here's some of the things that you really should be looking for if you're hoping that you don't get a, uh, a ripoff or a fake or a counterfeit so this is what the authentic, uh, the authentic uh, moose knuckles looks like so that's what you'll be looking for so again it's a really nice coat and again, I can't wait to see if this thing's really going to be waterproof, but uh, so they say. Uh, you got a lot of pockets. You got actually on the uh, bomber, you got one, two, you got three on the inside, four and five, so that's quite a few. The hood, I don't know if you're a, a fur person, but it is removable, but it is really, I thought this was the, the, the flashiest one, so I picked, the, I picked the white on black. Maybe a mistake, because you can kind of see they start getting these little, uh, pieces that kind of shed off of it. So hopefully I didn't make a mistake, but uh, I like it. And uh, I don't know, it's something that's a little bit different than the the true mainstream stuff, but uh, but it's still a high quality product. And if you're interested in, in finding something to uh, fit into your wardrobe, this one's a cool one. My favorite thing about this coat, it's a little design element that they have. They have the big industrial quality zipper, so it's really kind of beefy, it's really chunky. But what's uh, what I thought was kind of the coolest is the zipper pull. The zipper pull is actually a little axe, and the little axe has got the uh, the embossed moose knuckle logo. So hopefully you like it. If you wanted to pay retail for it, uh, it's, it's about 800 bucks pre-tax. But uh, you might be able to find them on sale, or you could hike up to uh, Canada and uh, get a, a favorable exchange rate. So I uh, hope you liked it, and uh, give it a shot.